Hello everyone, welcome back to another JBL Teardown. I truly appreciate all your suggestions and will do my best to implement them in future teardowns. In the meantime, let's dive into the newly released JBL Flip 7. This model brings several exciting upgrades to the Flip lineup, which we'll discover in this detailed teardown. So join me as we take apart the JBL Flip 7. The first step in this teardown is to remove the rear strap by pressing the push lock button. This strap is made of high quality material and can be interchanged with the included carabiner. I really appreciate the push lock system concept as it offers the user the flexibility to choose between the two different attachments. Next step, just like any model in the JBL Flip lineup, we will need to pry it off the speaker grill. This cover closely resembling the one on the Flip 6, featuring the same high quality material and design. One cool fact is that the fabric is created entirely from 100% recycled materials with the speaker using 77% recycled plastic, which I think adds an eco-friendly touch to its design. Next we'll remove 5 screws to take off the battery cover. This cover not only functions as a battery compartment cover, but also contains the push lock system for the strap and carabiner, as well as being a protective cover for the charging port and LED status light. Now we can unplug and remove the battery. And here with the battery. It's a 3.6 volt, 4800 mAh battery with a charge time of just 2.5 hours and a play time of up to 14 hours. For those moments when you need a little extra battery life, the Playtime Boost feature provides an additional 2 hours of use. Next, to access the charging port, we will need to take off 4 screws to remove this plastic cover. Next, we will remove the tweeter by taking off two screws and then gently prying the tweeter out. Here with the tweeter, it measures 16mm and rated at 10 watts. These are redesigned that enhances higher frequency, delivering crisp and clear sound. This improvement adds depth to the overall audio experience, complementing the powerful bass provided by the woofer. Next, we will remove the woofer by removing four screws. Here we have the woofer. It measures 45mm and is rated at 25 watts, and is designed to deliver powerful, clearer bass even at maximum volume. Next, we can pry off the passive radiator. This passive radiator enhances the bass, making it deeper and more pronounced. The radiator itself is detachable from the frame, making it simple to replace if needed. To remove the motherboard, we will need to take out a single screw and disconnect a few cables connections. This will allow us to slide the motherboard out with ease. Here we have the motherboard, featuring Bluetooth 5.4 and JBL Pro Sound with AI Sound Boost. The AI technology analyzes your music in real time to deliver exceptional acoustic performance with minimal distortion. 
It also utilized Orocast, enabling the pairing of multiple JBL speakers for a seamless audio experience. Additionally, it is compatible with the JBL Portable app, providing access to support updates and customization audio controls. Next, we will move the charging board by detaching the ribbon cable and sliding it out. This board features a modern USB-C port that ensures fast and convenient charging. Additionally, it includes a USB-C charging protection feature which alerts you to unplug if the connector detects water, salt, or any chemicals. Next, we can pop out the LED indicator lights. There are a total of 6 LEDs that display your battery life and charging status. Next, we will remove the silicone button to access the control boards. Here, we have the two control boards attached to the enclosure with double-sided tape. These boards provide the user with all the speaker functionalities. And this completes the teardown of the JBL Flip 7. If you're new to the channel and enjoy a video like this, feel free to join the channel. There's plenty more teardown of popular speaker and many more in future videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.